Hello, welcome back everyone. MPDS VPN walkthrough tutorial 3 is in this tutorial we're gonna configure about the um, all the CE routers here. As I mentioned um, in the previous tutorial, the CE router doesn't have the, any idea about the MPLS, so they will be just um, configuring the IP address and they will run the necessary protocols. In this example here in the router 9, router 9 gonna be running BGP65444. So neighbor with this router 4, which is P this interface, and which is the AS85. So in this router 10, gonna be running BGP, and in this router 11, gonna be running um, RIP version 2, and this router gonna be running EAW12. So in here we call it PECE routing protocols. In this case, PEC gonna be BGP, RIP version 2, EAGRP, default route, BGP and we're going to be running OSPF and AIGRP. So let's take a look at this and um, we will be configuring um, our CE routers. So here I have, um, I prepare the CE router config, just an IP address here. And in this, um, I would like to um, highlight this. We have the router 15 and 16 here. So 15 and 16 here, and we define the 172.16.15 or 15 or 15 slash 24, which is our loopback. We define here as the LAN, and also it, it it's the same 172.16.15 or 15 or 15. And here we have um, route 11 and 12. The LAN IP address are the same 172.16.11.11 11 slash 24 and 172, 16, or 11, or 11, 24 here. So, which is not wrong, which is right, correct. Okay, so, um, this is the router 9, CE router, which is CE Singapore 1, this is Singapore 2, this is the IP address, I just pasted it. And this is for router 10, And uh, router 11. And router 12. And here we have 13. Fourteen fifteen here. The last one going to be sixteen. Okay, so, um, I also prepare the routing config, which is pretty simple. And uh, in this router 9, which is our CE router, it's going to be running the BGP65444. So the neighbors will be 192.168.49.01, which is this PE, this interface. And I just advertise this um, 172.169.0.24. So I just, I just copy and paste this here. For router 10, it's still will be the same, which is the one running in BGP 65445. And router 11 going to be running RIP version 2. So this is the command. Router 12 will be running EAGRP. So 
so we need to define route 11 and 12 going to be len will be 172.16.11.11 .11. so let's let me verify again 172.16.11 and 12 is 172.16.11 all right and um, let's move on to router 13 router 13 going to be running default route so which is pretty straightforward So here 0 0.0.0.0 0 .0 .0 0 .0. Okay, we're going to be 192.166.63.1 one. this guy And London will be running BGP 65444 and um, YGN Yangon will be running ENGB 15 autonomous number 15 And the last one, MDY will be running OSPF 16A1. Sorry, I should have put. Uh, I just define causes out of cost. Okay, um, so this is the pretty much um, the everything that CE customer site need to configure. So neighbor with the PE and they just advertise whatever they want to advertise the loopback. So that's all about the um, CE router configurations and. The objective is from this CE routers from here. Let's say example, if it's wanna wanna go to Japan here, it's gonna be passing through the MPLS VPN backbone, going through here. So <clears throat> now it's like CE, so if everything is already done on the CE side. They just just need to neighbor with their PE and they just advertise their whatever loopbacks that they want to advertise. And so nothing much um, we need can we need to verify here just that we can only verify what, what are the things that what are the IP addresses that we've configured correctly on the CE routers and the routing protocols and the neighbors that we configure correctly all right so on the next tutorials we're gonna move on to <clears throat> on this service provider um, backbone we we have to we still have to configure a lot of stuff on here to get the communication from the CE to CE from here to here from here to here from here to here, from all here, here to here. All right, so um, thank you very much and see you in the ne next tutorial.